Hi, Seabird Spruce here, back with another Factoria Plus Plus video, episode 19, and, well, I need to get rid of this lake, it's blocking me bus. <laughs> I really need to do this, and it takes an obscene amount of landfill to do so. I'm also going to get all the fish in here, because I know the fish can't respawn, and um, fish are quite useful. And I even saw research that seemed to involve fish. It was one of the modded ones. So it was somewhere in here, but it was like, it was like medicine. It was interesting, but we're not really focusing on modded at this point. Um, we're more going to focus on blue science because that is just more crucial. So you can see I kind of already have engine units planned out, kind of. Before I do this, though, I kind of just want to build, okay, not, not here, um, I, I want to build the last... Um, I built a few more red signs, and I'm just doing this so I can, um, yeah, this is how much space I'm going to have for our engine units, which is stupid, but I think I've, ma I've made an engine unit build that uses that amount of space, so it shouldn't be too bad. Um, can also, actually, uh, uh, no, wait, it's, it's going to be more efficient to do it this way. This is stupid how I'm doing it this way, but it's, it's just gonna, it's gonna work. Um, I'm gonna split like this. And then go here, put an underground belt, and then just combine this into a single belt. Do another underground. That's all the undergrounds, and then just do this, and then put like the same inserter scheme as before, and this will double the max production of red science. So it's it's not that useful, but it's something. So now, the thing is, yeah, I'm going to want engine units, and more than just this non-automated engine unit thing, because, yeah, we need automation for this if we want to make blue science. And actually, at this point, I don't even... I can just cancel the research. It saves the progress of the research, so I don't have to worry about that. And I want to do this instead, because I really... I'm so close to making blue science at this point that I don't really need to... Um, to do it. The... I, I, what was, I don't even know what I was going to say. But anyway, to make engine units, what you need is... Um, so you need to do it in a, an assembling machine. That's one thing. This is so weird. Advanced assembly machine three. Why don't they just do it? This is the whole half-life thing all over again. They can't say four. Okay. Anyway, there's steel, gears, and pipes. That's we need, and you need to an assembly machine. So, well, yeah, I'm gonna make pipes, and just like like this, and. I think it just go. It, I, I can just put it here, and I can just do this, and then I know that I'm probably gonna want a little bit more for this, for this sort of engine units. I can also put a couple more landfill here, just so I can try to place a few more assembling machines. You know, I really am I really like one tile short. I guess I can do it the spaghetti way then. Yes, there's a spaghetti way for everything. I guess I okay. I I, I really want to. I just want that one tile. Okay, I have to do it the spaghetti way, unfortunately. So, what I mean by the spaghetti way is that um, first I put underground here, and then I do this. It is not efficient but it will work essentially this will be the ingredients um, also I need to move this like this um, to, to here at least I'm gonna have three engine unit factories I'm I may actually need tier two assemblers for this because I probably will need it to be slightly faster than this so essentially yeah this is the input this is well, actually, I probably should assign this. So this will be pipes, and this will be 
um, engine units. And to do this, yeah, it's just, all, all I need is um, the pipes are here. I can do I can do this, which again is awkward, but it works. By if, if I just put electric poles in the right places, I can I can make it work. And then, so this is the, the input. Um, inserters will go here, like normal. I guess I can take from the bottom belt for this iron. So this just needs to... Well, I, I, I need the actual... Oops, that's not what I planned to delete. I wanted to delete this electric pole because it was in the way. So this electric pole will just be used to make pipes. I probably want a fast inserter for this, actually. And I can do this. This is where actually the other ingredients will go. I'll, I'll, I'll do this first. So this, these will be gears. This will go like this into making engine units. And this will be steel. There's the iron and we have the gears. So now all I need is the output for um, this and this for the engine units and this will go ooh, that's not okay I, I just all I need to do is just move this slightly um, oh no no that's not good that's not good take all the steel um, I hate it when this happens okay I'm good now what I can do instead is I, I think I can do this and then take this from Hopefully there's no random steel on the right side. Oh, there is random steel on the right side. That's, yeah, I, I, it was probably just when I placed that first belt down. So, now, okay, what I can do now is place this, place this, just do this. And then this will work. Because now, okay, I need, I need a red underground for this. I need it to go five and this is maybe it's not even worse because I can just do this and this will actually work for wherever my blue science building is going to be and that is probably going to be on the south side because we're running out of room on the north side <laughs> and it's just easier like the materials are already kind of relatively far south at this point so it isn't that much of a deal of, of a bad thing for them to be farther south the one thing is that means I need a lot more underground builds because I don't have enough so I'll probably just base where this build is I'll just base it on where this the engine units will be and it'll be right here which is right near the water again Again, these are more lakes I want to get rid of. I can't believe of all resources I'm running out of, I'm running out of stone. Which is like the most... Other than uranium, in the vanilla game, there's like way too much stone. And... Um, like how much is this down to? It's down to now 80k? Yeah, it's not all that much. And... I mean, I may want to stop building making more landfill um you can see how much oh man i'm already out or not out but I'm already like out of resources there's so much junk in my inventory this is ridiculous like this um there's stone bricks for some reason i guess i'm just gonna need another chest here um i don't know what these diamonds are but they're not useful at this point so i'll do this there's a ton of sulfur which Okay, once I build those assembly machines that are actually making um, blue science, I can I can put them there. Oh man, wow, we're really we're really consuming a lot of resources now. Okay, so this is a decent amount of landfill. Out, that's eight thirty eight. No, that's not eight thirty. That's seven thirty eight. Okay, so that is fairly good. That's actually like if you take the square root of that, that tells you like the amount. Um, the length by length you can do, and that much is, um, 
about 27 by 27, which is pretty decent. It's definitely not the size of the lake to the left, but it probably is big enough to cover this entire lake with plenty to spare, which is very nice. And we can see how much of this lake we can do. And I'll probably just do it right to left because that's where the bus is. Of course, I want to get all the fish as I possibly can. Okay, that's like half of the lake. So I, I will definitely accept that. I'll just let this go on for another 800 landfill and then I will stop making landfill. So you can see here are the engine units and to make blue science you need um, one sulfur, three red circuits, and two engine units. This means that I'm going to put sulfur on the other side of the belt. And unlike the military science, there's kind of an inefficient design with how it's kind of done, like the outputs are on both sides. I'm going to make the input on both sides because that's, that's just better. Um, it'll be kind of like the red circuit build, which is a build I really like. Um, okay, I gotta spare every belt I can. I'm gonna do it like this instead. Instead of making it neat, I'm gonna save every last possible belt. So, sulfur is gonna go here. This means red circuits will probably go like here or something. Yeah, there's another road I want to build here. Um, that's kind of awkward how I need to... I just need to grab some more of... Um, I just need to grab some a few, a few more. Which I can also grab the regular stone so I can make even more landfills. Because, yeah, I'm going to need landfill. Or That's nine landfill. That's how, how good all that stone was. Like, you can see, that's why it's... Yeah, it's crazy expensive to make landfill, at least in the early game like this. Later on, you'll be you'll be making millions of stones, so you can make um, tens of, or even hundreds of thousands of landfill, and that will be like hundreds times hundred. Okay, yeah, yeah, you can see it is so annoying. You even need a stone, you even need stone bricks in your hand or in or in your inventory if you want. To delete stone bricks from from this, and it's not that much, but it's like the length of this road that you need to that you misplaced. That's painful. I can't really do that. Um, do the same thing as the red circuit build because there's two inputs. Um, instead, I can just do it like this, I guess. So, which. Which do I want to be on the inside? Which do I want to be on the outside? I think um, I think the inside can be the stone and um, yeah, the, the, not the stone, the sulfur and oh, not electric engines. Electric engines are a thing, but um, engine units. So um, I also need to make more assembly machines. I want I'll just do eight, like I'm doing with all the others. And I don't need the last one because I already have one. What I'll do here is it'll start like right here, I guess. I, 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 I'm not exact. Yeah, I probably want to weave everything a little bit to the left of some of the others. So that's why I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this. Is there one spot of water here? Yes, there is. There's literally one. It's so annoying when you miss the when you miss one little thing of water. Yeah, I took the stone like that because I don't want to take all the other stuff. Because that's junk. And I have enough for one landfill. Actually, I have ten landfill. I didn't need to do that. But whatever. So yeah, this will also be split into... Something like this. Oops. I need to get one more to the right. And... Just, yeah, four, four more assemblers here. Um, I will need to just do this 
because this is where I'm gonna output the um, the blue science. This is something I, I can use slow inserters on, but I I may eventually want fast. I know I, I don't. I'm not gonna need fast inserters for something like this. Just do do it like this. This is. You know, I really am missing one like inserter. Yay! So I'll just build all the like inserters I can here. So this is where all the slow inserter so will go. Just, nope. They they go into the machines. Not out of them. It's only those lanky ones that go out. So this is the plan for blue science, and I've actually noticed something. I'm not producing red circuits, and I know the reason why. It's because of this. You can see no steel is being used. Like, no steel. Even with this priority. I will try to fix that. Um, I know a way I can balance that with using just like a very simple method. And here I probably want to use a big electric pole to to get this all the way down to this because using any other method would, would just take a lot of electric poles. So yeah, so I can just do this and this and this and just put, yeah, just do all this. That's essentially the build. Now, of course, I'm going to need to um, take this underground. I'm probably going to um, spaghetti the blue signs this way. So, like, under here. Which means, yes, it takes even more um, of these. And I'll just use the standard chest buffer, as I always do. And then blue science can go like this. Oh, I'm really missing just a few belts here. Just not like that. I do like this. And so this is where all of the blue science will go. Now all I need to do is connect like this to the other um, blue science thing. And luckily there's a bunch of like three, there's a lot of room here that I can just do this. And that's where, that's the blue science build. I'll, now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to fix the thing with the steel. I don't, this will not fully alleviate problems, but this will partially help. Oh wait, really I just got rid of, I destroyed my electric pole. This is why I like to use big electric poles. I don't really use medium ones all that much because they're they don't do much more than the small ones, but um, they cost like ten times more for like twice the value. So the easy fix here that I'm talking about is this. All this does is it can go on both lanes, which means that if all the steel is, is being taken from the right lane, now it can use this as well. Now I don't think it's gonna fully alleviate problems. That's the problem. <laughs> My steel consumption is so low for some reason. I don't get it. Well, while I wait for all of this to happen, I just noticed there's a new butter base and it's kind of large. So I will go take that out. And now, yeah, the biter evolution is a lot higher, which means medium biters exist. Yay! Which means it's harder um, to take everything out. There's also spitters exist in this evolution, but. Um, I don't think spitters are that, um, bad for this. But with five of these combat drones, it's still relatively easy to take out a biter base, even of this size. So, yeah, that's about it. Um, all I really need to do is just assign this to blue science once this finishes, and next episode I'm gonna start working on solar panels, because this... Is going not only is going to create electricity, it's going to um, use up copper and steel, which are two resources that I need to be using more of if I want the more valuable stuff. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out. Mm -hmm.